Hello everybody, welcome to another video. Uh, in today's video, it's a bit of a different one. Um, we're going to be doing my end of season predictions for League 2. Now, this is going to be a series of all the English leagues. And maybe I'll move on to, you know, the other leagues such as the Serie A, the um, Bundesliga... Like all those leagues, uh, Ligue 1 in France, I could do those if these videos do well. But I'm just going to be giving my predictions on where teams are going to finish in these leagues. And well, where better off to start than League 2, where my team currently are, Gillingham. Um, so we're going to be just discussing, or well, me discussing to myself really, which teams are going to be promoted to League One and which teams are going to get relegated to the National League and which teams are going to finish mid-table. Right, so we're going to start off with the teams that I think are going to be promoted automatically. So I think that, well, as you can see on the table here, Leighton Orient, they will come second in the league. Stevenage will come first, so Stevenage will be league champions. Carlisle, they're going to come fourth or fifth, and Northampton's going to come third. Um, yeah, so that, and so it's going to be Stevenage coming first, Leighton Orient second, Northampton Town third. That's who's going to be automatically promoted. <clears throat> And then through the playoff system, so any teams from 7th to 4th where they compete against each other, I think the team that will win and be promoted in the playoff will be Carlisle. Now the teams that I think will finish mid-table, obviously now looking at the mid-table now, we've got some strong sides here, Doncaster, Wimbledon, Sutton, Barrow, Bradford, um, just to name a few. Looking at some of these teams' form, so you've got Doncaster, they've lost three out of their last five, but they've won two out of their last five. Um, Tranmere lost two out of their last five, won one out of their last five, drew, drew two. They're struggling for form. Walsall, um, same here really, one win out of the last five, two draws, two losses. Uh, yeah, and Sutton... They've got a draw, a win, a loss, a draw, and a win. So these are the... And Barrow, Barrow as well. Uh, draw, loss, loss, draw, win. The, these are the teams that I think are going to finish mid-table in this competition. Now let's just go to the teams that I think will suffer the relegation. So going down to the bottom two, currently we do have Gillingham and Rochdale. Gillingham have played two less games than Hartlepool and Rochdale. So I think we are going to survive relegation and maybe finish 19th or 20th if we keep on getting all these points. Look, three wins out of our last five, one, lo uh, one loss, one draw. That's pretty good form. And we've only played 27 games when some teams have played 30. So yeah. The teams that I think will be relegated to the National League this season, first step of non-league football, will be Rochdale, because they've only won one out of their last five, and they've lost four. And I think the second team that will go down will be Crawley Town, because they are struggling for form at the moment, as you can see. One win up the last five, three losses, one draw. Uh, anyway, that is, this is just my prediction. This is not based off of any fact whatsoever. It's just my personal opinion on where teams are going to finish. So if you don't agree with me, that's you have every right to disagree with me. But um, anyway, I know this is a bit of a different video than what I usually do. But I just wanted to try this out. If you want me to do other leagues, let me know what league you would like me to do, and I will do that for you. But first, I need to complete the English Football League. So I'm going to go League 1, Championship, Premier League. 
maybe move to the Irish League, the Scottish Premiership, if you guys want that. And then we'll start moving south to the League 1, Bundesliga, uh, Syria, all those professional leagues. But yeah, thank you for watching this video. Comment, like and subscribe. And hopefully I'll see you in the next one. Bye.